to my channel if you are new hi my name is naledi and thank you for joining us on today's video if you are returning sabi welcome back and thank you so much for the love please do not forget to like to comment and to subscribe to my channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a collective haul i'm basically going to be showing you dolls the things that i bought and wasted my money on within the last two weeks and because all of these items were bought within the last two weeks this video can sort of be a plug video if you see anything that you like interested in or want to purchase they all still available at their respective stores i got a few things from shein mr price zara foshini and a few other stores so if you're interested in seeing any of the things that i bought please keep on watching this so video. i'm gonna start with the shein stuff and from Shein, I got three, four, five, six. From Shein, I got seven items, and I'm gonna be starting with this. I got a basic black beauty blender, and then I got uh, these two puffers. I feel like that's what you call them a makeup puff or a powder puff i'm not really sure what you call it they've been trending on youtube they've been trending on ig and on tiktok so they basically those puffers that people use to set their under eye so they came as a pack of three basically they came together as the beauty blender and the two puffers and that is the first item that i got and i got this because i wanted to try it out because of the hype that was around it so yeah that is the first item that i got so the next thing that i got is this necklace it is a necklace with the letter n my name is naledi so that is the reason that i got it it is gold in color it's nothing too it's a nice simple chain i believe it was like eight rand or something like that so this is what it looks like it is a really cute item and i'm really glad girl it really is a cute item and i'm glad that i did get it because i know that this is not real gold i'm going to do my absolute best to try and keep it away from water so the next item that i got is a swimsuit set and i know it's currently winter in south africa but you can never have enough swimsuits and i do try my best to buy swimsuits throughout the year so that when i am going to a place where i need a swimsuit i don't need to be buying it last minute so the swimsuit that i bought is it's a green swimsuit and they are those basic triangle swimsuits here's the underwear that you tie on the sides and then the bra which is also a basic triangle sort of swimsuit bra yeah a swimsuit bra and then it has this sort of long sleeve cardigan which you wear obviously the cardigan on your upper body and you tie between your boobs i am going to be including pictures of the items on the website and their prices is probably going to be on this side of the screen so i got this swimsuit in a small i generally get all my swimsuits in a size small i'm normally a size medium but when it comes to swimsuits most of them i just size down so this is the first clothing item that i got from shein absolutely love the set green is not one of my favorite colors but i just thought i should try something different and see how it looks on my skin tone so that is it for the first item that i got the second clothing item that i got is also green and it is a two-piece set a pair of shorts basically yeah a pair of shorts and a short sleeve shirt this is how it looks it's also green like i did say i wanted to try a different color and see how it looks on my skin that is the reason why i bought this set absolutely love this as well so this is the second clothing item i got it in a medium 
absolutely love this absolutely love how it looks on me and my body the fit is great and the color is great on my skin as well and this is something that i can also wear with the previous item that i showed which is the green swimsuit maybe if you're going to the beach of course you'll be wearing your bikini on the inside and then just wear this two piece on the outside but it's something that you can also wear on its own in summer so absolutely absolutely love this set and then i'm gonna go to the next item that i got so if you've been a doll and an og subscriber you know just how much i love my legging and biker biker short set so the next two items are exactly that the first item or the first set that i got is in this sort of army green color and it is a crop top and a pair of biker shorts and i got this in a a size small and to be honest i do not like the fit of this i feel like i could have gone with an extra small but i of course didn't know because it's my first time purchasing the shein sets so this is sort of big i'm not sure if i'm gonna take it to a tailor or resell this because i was planning on wearing this next week so i don't know what's gonna happen it does fit me but not the way that i normally like my sets to fit the top is quite big i don't know why on earth this would be considered a size small but this is the set so i'm not really sure if i'm just gonna wear this as is or if i'm really not sure i'll see how that goes but if i do not like this i'm definitely going to be reselling this i feel like it would fit someone that's more of a a big medium or a smaller large i don't know if i'm making sense but this is the first set i would maybe give it a six out of ten the second set i absolutely love i also got this in a small and this one is in that sort of ribbed material it is these biker shorts and a crop top like i said it was the first time purchasing these from shein so i was surprised to see that they have that boob padding the one that you get in your swimsuits absolutely love that as someone that has no boobs and the quality is amazing for the price because i feel like the pricing is similar to the mr price ones so from now on i'm just gonna buy these sets from shein they're not too transparent as the ones from Mr. Price because with the one from Mr. Price, you literally need to wear tights on the inside because if not, the next person will be able to see your underwear or your skin. And I don't think I'm going to be having that problem with these ones because they are thick. Absolutely love that. And they are these brown color. I have this color with the Mr. Price ones as well, but with the long leggings and not the biker sets so that is it when it comes to the biker shorts or the biker sets the last item which i got is this trick suit and to be honest this was the one thing that i was most looking forward to absolutely loved this on the website and as i got it absolutely loved the quality as well this is a trick suit set it is a pair of trek pants and a crop sort of sweater this is how the pants look they have this sort of crisscross waist situation going on and to be honest the quality is quite good and i feel like this was 400 and something so for the price the quality is absolutely good i got this in a size small i don't know why i always downsize with my clothing but i feel like i am in between a small and a medium i'm not really a medium so that is why i tend to get small in some items and this is the cropped sort of uh sweater top or yeah sweater that's what you call it absolutely love this set and unfortunately it is too small for me it is tight on my butt and hip area so i feel like this would fit a small like i said or someone that is a medium but has a small uh, butt or hip area so i'm definitely going to be reselling this I'm going to try it on on the side for you so you can see how it looks absolutely love this as well and i am going to be repurchasing this in a medium that's how much i loved it 
now that i've seen the quality as well and how it looks in person absolutely love this and that brings us to the end of the shein items that i got and a quick summary of the shein items the total was 1271 rand i paid 115 for customs and they used buffalo logistics to ship it and i literally got my order in seven days because seven business days that is because i ordered this on the 13th at night and i got it this past monday which was the i feel like the 20 24th or the 23rd i'm not really sure but i did count the days and it was literally seven days so absolutely love that for me so now i'm gonna go to the next items which i got from mr price so from mr price i got four items some i got in store and some i got online i'm just gonna start with this small package and inside we have a skirt so the first item that i got is a parachute skirt parachute clothing are literally in trend right now and they look absolutely good so i got this in a medium from mr price and it was 199 rand it is just a parachute skirt has this sort of adjusting elastic on the waist and it does not have um ones on the side or at the bottom but it is a simple black parachute skirt from mr price absolutely love this i cannot wait to style this and then the next item i also got from mr price is also a very trendy item it is these pair of sort of metallic sunglasses and they were 80 rands um absolutely love these as well and i don't really have a scissor right now so i'm just gonna wear them with the price tag this is how they look on me to be honest they are giving very fashion forward vibes and i don't think i can wear them with my lashes because they're a bit uncomfortable right now as i do have strip lashes but this is how they look and i feel like they don't suit me with this hairstyle but they definitely look good with a bob and that is how i am planning on styling them so that is the second item that i got from mr price a simple pair of sort of silver grayish sunglasses and those are the first two items that i got from mr price and in the other mr price bag i got these platform deals i actually have these in pink as well but i also needed a black pair because i already have an outfit for this and they were 200 rand but the initial price or the normal retail price was i think 350 but when i bought them they were 200 rand and i would say they are comfortable but they are slippery so i don't know if i just need to sandpaper the bottom or i need to get a good wear out of them before they start being like being able to grip the floor but absolutely love these heels planning on wearing them this winter with a blazer so yeah that is it with these and then the last item that i got from mr price is a pair of parachute jeans parachute this parachute that absolutely love these jeans i've worn them before they are a sort of a dad or mom style straight leg parachute vibe kind of jeans absolutely love this like i've said i've worn this before i wore it twice before and every single time that i wear these jeans people ask me where i got them absolutely beautiful i am gonna wear them so you see how they look they sort of have this i don't know what detail to call this but they sort of have a detail a stitch or i really don't know what to call it absolutely love these jeans they have two basic simple pockets at the back like i said absolutely love this i feel like this was my best mr price purchase it's definitely between these and the high heels but because i do have a fault with the high heels because i said they were a bit slippery so i'm just gonna give it to this denim jean this is my best mr price purchase so that is about it from mr price so the next item that i'm going to be showing you is from zara i got one item from zara and honestly i feel like it's one of my favorite items in the whole collection i feel like it's my second 
uh, best or second yeah second purchase in the whole collection because my favorite purchase is going to be the one that I leave for last and it's a pair of shoes but my second best purchase from this whole collection is what I'm going to be showing you next like I said it's from Zara it is a pair of straight leg faux leather pants absolutely love this i've honestly wanted this for the longest time and i got this in a size 10 i believe and you know zara and its prices it was 860 rand but i do not regret this buy and i did want to buy it from a quality store because i do plan on wearing this for years to come absolutely love these pants i am going to be abusing them this winter i have so many outfits in my head that i have planned already so this is the pair of pants that i got from zara i love how soft the faux leather is and i also love the length of these because even when i wear them with heels they still sort of go down the heel i am going to be wearing the hell out of this so please do not judge me the next this item i got is from take a lot and i am showing you this after the leather pants because it is a entire outfit as is and it's one of the ways that i'm planning on wearing the leather pants this is a corset top that i got from take a lot and um i kind of bought this off take a lot before i realized that they also had it on shein for a fraction of the take a lot price and it looked exactly the same so this is the corset i absolutely love it anyway so that is my only regret when it comes to this corset top that i should have bought it from shein if i was aware that they had it on shein but i absolutely love this corset top I got it in a size small from one of the vendors on take a lot and it does fit very well but i'm a person that does not have big boobs so it does look a bit awkward on the boob area i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna make a plan to make sure that my boob area looks full when i wear it and it comes with this matching g-string i don't know what the purpose or the point was but that's how you get it they come together and that is what I got from Take A Lot and I absolutely love it. Hi dolls, welcome back. Please do not mind the change of scenery. It is literally a few hours later and a totally different location. But I had to do what I had to do to complete this video. So without wasting any time, let's continue with our collective haul. So I also got a few items from Foshini, the first one being this white t-shirt that I have on. It is a basic white sort of turtleneck mock neck t-shirt and it is not a full length t-shirt. It is sort of a crop top, not really crop crop top. It is sort of a three quarter crop top, I guess that's what you call it because it's not literally under your boobs it's like just below my belly button so this is the first item that i got from Fushini, and it is in this ribbed material i'm not sure if it's picking up on camera but i absolutely love this and the next item is very similar it is also a sort of a crop top three quarter weight crop top it's from the brand y and g i got this in a size medium and the difference between this and this is that I believe this is a cotton material but I also believe this is cotton material as well just ribbed but this one is a plain normal basic t-shirt cotton material t-shirt it is a round high neck yeah this is the second item that I got from Foshini and I believe this one was 130 rand not sure but i will include the pictures and the price of each item like i did say and then the next item which i got from Foshini is a handbag and this is how it looks it looks almost exactly like the zara one to be honest i saw the zara one first but i think it was a bit more expensive and they honestly almost look exactly the same i just believe the zara one has this material on the middle of the chain as well but this is how it looks and this was 300 rand 299 absolutely love this handbag it is a very small cute bag and it does fit quite a lot on the inside 
and on the inside it has that um, Foshimi Fendi Mimic sort of logo and yeah that is about it nothing much that I got from Foshimi I also got a few pair of underwears but that's a bit TMI the second last item that I am going to be showing you dolls is a set from Boss Lady Dressed this is a IG sort of boutique it is a store on IG and it is a white two-piece so this is the bag that it came with and here are the details of the store and from Boss Lady Dress I got a white two-piece this is how it looks it is a turtleneck long sleeve crop top and it comes with this white very long skirt you wear it as a two-piece and honestly when i went to the store i fitted the black one because i wanted to see if it was see-through and the black one wasn't see-through but when i got home and actually fit the white one it is a bit see-through so i'm not really sure what i'm gonna wear on the inside to hide my underwear or anything like that but this is the two piece i think it was 500 rand if i'm not mistaken absolutely love this even though it's see-through and without wasting any time i'm going to be showing you dolls the last item that i got which is my absolute favorite item from the entire haul and it is a pair of heels from steve madden and to be honest i feel like they were a bit too expensive to be a pair of steve madden heels but they are absolutely gorgeous and they come in this brown steve madden box and i got them in a size 5 absolutely love these shoes i've always loved these shoes for a while but i was concentrating on the pricing because these shoes are literally 1000 800 rand i believe but i love them so much that i eventually did buy the shoes so this is how it looks it is the sort of cinderella slipper shoe absolutely love this shoe i've seen it on multiple people and i've always wanted to buy it so i am glad that i finally got it it's not the most comfortable shoe but for the size of the heel they are quite comfortable if that makes sense so this is the last item that i caught for my haul absolutely absolutely love these babies and i am going to be wearing them next week so if you want to see the outfit that i'm going to wear with this which was funny enough in this haul already so if you want to see how i style it please do follow me on instagram to see the outfit that i'm going to be putting together that brings us to the end of this collective haul i hope you guys enjoyed this collective haul and saw a few pieces that you'll be buying for yourself hope you enjoyed this video please do not forget to like to comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video hey. Hey.